Uh, all right, it's that time of year when weather is getting hotter by the day and many of us are spending more time outside. But there are some precautions you should take to make sure you keep your skin safe and healthy. Local 24 meteorologist Trevor Burchett has more. Summer in the Mid-South. It's hot, humid, and usually pretty sunny. But before you come out to Shelby Farms or take a dip in the pool, doctors say it's important to protect your skin. Skin cancer is the most common type of cancer. One in five people will get it at some point in their lifetime, and it can affect anyone regardless of skin tone. Dr. Samuel Riney is a hematology and oncology physician at the Methodist Cancer Institute and says most people that develop skin cancer have had long-term exposure to ultraviolet light. Whether that's from artificial UV rays from tanning beds uh, or from natural sunlight, uh, that is easily the number one factor that is causing most skin cancers. Fortunately, Dr. Riney says there are things you can do to lower your risk of getting skin cancer. Of course, the best way to protect your skin is to reduce exposure to sunlight as much as possible. But if you do plan to go out, be sure to use a broad spectrum sunscreen of SPF 30 or higher. It's also important to remember to reapply at least every two hours and more frequently if you're swimming. A good rule of thumb is to use about a shot glass worth of lotion to apply to your skin. And if you're thinking about getting a quick tan in a tanning bed, you may want to think again. Dr. Riney recommends using alternatives like self-tanning lotion or even a spray tan. And yes, tanning beds, a lot of times you are getting a large UV exposure in a short amount of time. Uh, so I would say that those are not really safe. Although skin cancer is the most common type of cancer, Dr. Riney also says it's one of the most preventable. He says you can enjoy the sun as long as you take some precautions. You know, everybody wants to be out in the sun, and it's okay to go out in the sun and have a good time. Just people need to be careful. And of course, in addition to protecting your skin, it's also important to stay hydrated and take frequent breaks in the shade if you're outside for a long period of time. Reporting in East Memphis, I'm meteorologist Trevor Burchett, Local 24 News. Dr. Riney also adds that having just five blistering sunburns before the age of 20 increases your risk of developing skin cancer by 68%. To see a full list of the do's and don'ts when it comes to sunscreen, head to localmemphis.com.